Our new course is out. In it, you will learn to code a platform game character with Godot into the side scrolling. You will learn to create what you can see on screen right now. A character that can run around, that can jump, that can also use a hook to move around the level. A great opportunity to look at how to create a more complex setup than your average platforming game, something that scales and some of the best practices writing GDScript in Godot. So you will learn to create a finite state machine, a hierarchical one at that using separate nodes to separate the behaviors of your character. The advantage of that is that you can scale, you can add new moves to your character without breaking the rest of your codes or making it messy or hard to read. It's really good whether you are working alone or with teammates. You will also see how to create the hook that works a bit like a weapon, let's say. It's an element separate from the character that you can use to, as you could see, hook onto points around the levels. Oops, I fell. This course, like all the material that we make, sponsors our free and open source content, including the full game that the course is based on, that has some debug tools and code that's, again, entirely free and open source, available on GitHub right now. Link in the description, as usual. And we are also working on a beginner series to learn to create your first game with Godot. A bit like Mario, you know, you can bump onto enemies that are a bit like the Goombas, you can create coins and those kinds of things. This series will come completely for free on the channel. The code is also free and expect it mm, around the end of the month, when it's done, basically. That's our motto, right? But for now, please go check out the course. Again, link in the description. You can go watch the videos there and all. I want to thank you kindly for watching. Be creative, have fun. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.